Dear Tim and Moby, How do you make a brain pop movie? From Stacy. Oh, good question. We get this a lot. Making a brain pop movie is a pretty complicated process, but it all starts with your emails. Once I get a question, I start researching the answer. Sometimes I get help from other writers. I said help. Once all the research is done and everything's written and edited, we actually get to start making the movie. First, Moby and I sit down to record the script. Cut. I'm going to need you to say that again, uh, this time with more feeling. Next, the animators sketch a rough comic strip called a storyboard, which guides them as they animate the movie. Brain pop movies are created with digital animation. Digital animation uses computers to create moving images. To give the impression that figures are moving, slightly different images are put together in sequence. When the sequence is sped up, you get animation. There are lots of different kinds of digital animation. One popular type that you may have heard of is called computer-generated imagery, or CGI. That's what you often see in movies with really cool 3D special effects. Shh. Brain pop movies are in good old 2D. That's two dimensions. We use special software to create 2D animation. These programs let you reuse stuff over and over without having to redraw it. The main area where animators create the movie is called a stage. The illusion of depth is created by drawing background and foreground objects on different transparent layers. Each layer is made up of one or more still images called keyframes. The animator connects keyframes together to create the moving image. In a process called tweening, the animator picks a start point and end point for an object. Then the computer calculates the most natural path between the two points and voila, movement. When the animation's done, the audio that Moby and I recorded is synchronized to the movement. <laughs> Hey, that's better. Finally, we upload the files to the all-powerful BrainPop server. And there you have it. You can watch the new BrainPop movie on the internet. No special equipment required. Just press play. Whatever. I hate watching myself on screen anyway. It makes me feel so self-conscious. Besides, I have a massage I need to get to and a 1230 with my agent. Ciao, buddy.